He's earned his place. He's had a great year to get in the top 16. And makes his debut at the Masters. I actually just saw him briefly. He was coming down the stairs. I was going up the stairs. Ding, though, despite being a great champion. <coughs> And that is just the start he wanted. What a tough game. And also, at a huge venue like this, be the next stage, I think, it's in his... important if he can settle. It's all new to him. He did have that practice beforehand, just 15 minutes on the match table. That, of course, he came through yesterday against Mark Allen for Christmas. Very well done. Still got an up in the Masters. Particularly the curve at snooker can be you know, a tough one. A few defeats in qualifying. Now that is an annoying miss. And a surprise. Go. better than others it's almost computerized watching him so don't really travel up the table all that far all at this end for that reason he's quite high on the 147 but in this tournament still only had three in the history of the masters all by non be really looking to punish that miss on the black it came out of nowhere first he was looking he's as tough as anyone on the match table he was born to play this game i think one of those and uh he's been, he's been around a very long time yeah well he's only 16 when he made his debut and it looks like it's going to cost him in certain early rounds of tournaments not here you would think at the Masters. Not punish you, but when they do, it really drives the point home that you cannot miss easy ball. He's trying to be flash there. He's left himself a cost because the frame is not really over yet, despite a snooker being needed. Yeah. That's a pretty impressive contribution Ding from Ding Jim Wee. 66. I think we already Doesn't help though, does it, when you're in one oh. yourself? Come in the frame. Ding taking no chances, laying Wait, another snooker. And the frick. Has asked to miss Black with a break of 66. And also didn't really give Lazowski a realistic chance to play for snookers. He got him in one himself. Sharp. The winner of this match. First leg of the Coral Series. He's in that, so that'll be another special occasion for him. And of course, if he can stay in the top six. Not an easy shot here. Got to get that cue ball right under that cushion. He's managed it. I think the point you made about Lazowski, uh, he's done really well to get into the money list for each tournament. If you win an event, it's all about winning, really, getting in the higher ranks, but he's done it by sheer consistency. No Very fine point. Throwing their arms up in the end, saying these pockets are absolute buckets after that. Frame from it made a big break.
as well. Alexander Palace. Silence watching this. For this year. And when Bose has slipped back a bit. And some of the younger players. But like you say, down to just the one now, Chinese player. Hong Kong player Marco Fu is not the best player ever to come out of China by a mile. That may, of course, change at some point. Fingers. And it's about making that step up. We've talked already about it's taken Mazowski a while. Wow. Well, where on earth? Mazowski returned the favour here. One. Lost. Mistakes that have punished. Nine. And four reds are all lined up to the left corner. Gonna pot. He just flicked it. That's okay. <laughs> he thought. It's a fabulous shot. It's just beautiful. It makes the game look easy, Boss. doesn't it? Deep. Yeah, he's played on that red to the green pocket. I think. That's okay. Soundscape could have won them both, but for missing an easy pot in each frame. A jink. If you're a Jack Mazowski supporter. Yes, it is worrying for Lazowski because the standard at the Masters. He had his That's chance easy. there. I'm sure. If suit the more experienced players when <laughs> cover all the reds would be very difficult the reds are so widely spread yeah he hasn't managed Being it. John Wick. one Terrific red to the middle. Getting in first. Dreamland, this really for a snooker player. Don't it. But he's leading the safety stats. Well, 
this needs help. That was a poor shot. Me. No, I mean, when he came to the table, I don't what? think you ask Got to make something happen in this match. Cushion will certainly come into play here. See how he can get his nose in. Thirteen. Picks a bit near the cushion anyway, actually. Yes, I think Jack mentioned in his interview that he's got to play a little differently than he can. A bit, but opted for a brilliant shot. Now, now he's done the right. Thing. Most unlucky three frames, but may be about to go three nil down. Played it because yellow comes back up. That is he will need the pink. Yes, it... Oh, we've seen some terrific shots in... We just couldn't do it. Been that many close frames, he had a respot this afternoon in the... That was out. Very, very thin, though. Yeah. Well, the double is on here. Straight away, he knew he'd missed it by a long way. Well, now. more difficult than it looked that shot <laughs> difficult as it is opting for the safety option Too thin. From this crowd. Oh, a few 
you thought it was in, at least it's... Oh, that's really good. Getting a bit worrying in this. <coughs> That's another good shot. From Dangerous, but to win his first frame. Oh. He's still not in. the frames in the snooker shootout. Maisie <laughs> looking at the score. Push the black into play here. Oh, they played it. I think a billiard player would have got it. Jack think it was worth going for. The fact is, he never even looked at it. I think that's the right shoddy play. Get in, but nothing easy. The pink is still not in. That was probably his best chance of it. The ball just won't fit into the pocket. Crowd loving this, as I say, it's not all big breaks, but it's drama. Safety shots, actually. It's one of those shots where he can go. going to be, you'd think, pretty good. Add to that, the pot is not easy in the first place. <laughs> I like the way he had another look at the scoreboard. The old up and down the spots, which Spencer and Reardon, but this is proper old school stuff. Somewhere locked away in a vault. Well, that's okay. It makes oh. well, it makes a difference in that he's gonna have to. Pink ball. Oh, that's a different way of playing it. Oh, wow. Can you believe? Played the cross double there. It's not bad, is it? Got away with one, I think. Yeah, that's a better shot. Needs them both. Yeah, you 
might well say it's old school, Dave. I don't think I ever remember anything like that. Yeah, that's a fabulous pot. Now then, can he get past the black? Cut back. Going for it. He's what? Oh, that's a good pop considering what we've just been through. Yes, because the red doesn't go. Wow. It was a cheeky old shot. to that pretty bruising third frame. Well, that's right. I mean, every one of those chances had a degree of difficulty about it. You have to move on, and what it really means is this, and now he's... Match. on the table he's had some off the table of course he was very ill when he was young in the form of cancer he's on that red still see it the balls are running around he has no control and he's been lucky there cue ball control is everything you have to play shots like that We heard him say it as he. <coughs> well, again, getting very uncomfortable at the moment. Good shot. Well, I'd cushion. Put the high value color, I put a color out of the game. That's the only shot. Jack Lisowski found that this frame could also be yet be snatched away. Didn't want that. Did he want the flu? It's an underlying feeling that he could nick this frame as well. Yes, it's not entirely safe, though, is it? as possible it's a bit ragged I'm as neat I think the way the balls have finished, it's really helped him there, you know. That red going by the brown, that means he can't pot it. And that motivates someone in that position, but I think with any luck, he'll be all right here in this frame. What a shot that is. That's the most magnificent.
Japón. problem with it. Not that, anything but that. get behind this pink here you know such a good player at these sort of situations Zaski's had chances in every single frame particularly this one but Ding has taken it what a stumes after the interval what a nightmare third and fourth frame for him That was a chance, it wasn't. <coughs> Superbly, but Luca Purcell was that little bit better. <coughs> Cess on the low side, but of course we had that epic duel in frame three, and of course frame four was also very tight. That was close, that red. Wasn't a dead plot. Dealing with Jack Mizowski at the mid-session interval, if he was in a dressing room or wherever he was, that's been hard work. Anyway, Ding didn't. Sounds obvious, but while you've got an opponent down, you've really got to just finish them off using pocket as best you can. It's a good shot. The other one he lost, which tells you that he's been kind of in every. <laughs> Goes some way the free in the black. And of course, I said earlier, he's one of these players who's got the most beautiful touch around the black smoking, but when it does, it's a joy to watch him.
much more. He missed a very easy red right-handed. Well, chance for a century now. And of course, a maximum ding at the Masters. Really nice. And roll balls in because he's got the perfect angle on the next one every time. 4 0, and now he needs the green for a century. Delightful stuff from Ding. Kazowski looking demoralised. 100 to a nightmare. Clearance of 120 from victory. Foul. Well, Well, he certainly looked at something in there. It must... well, we had to get that to start the break. That's not the worst shot, even though the red didn't go in. The player was going to the 16 on Pukov. He's more like it. Six. And the worst thing about this, actually, and I think Jack just said, Frayne, we'll probably bring the house down. Uh, I guess, though, in terms of his few, got to the second round there, but lost 13 1. Got to the final of the Riga Masters this season, was a bit unlucky. So, obviously, he was already a great champion, Neil. But. Please, what snooker needs? 13. <laughs> Do you see this in matches where player thinks 59 in front? Well, that was out. Then get to the red through the gap. <laughs> Made a double. Yes, and it goes. Well, Mazowski opens the count at long last. Would say is he is capable because the speed he plays. If he oh. hits a groove, but the main thing is he's not been whitewashed. Because I don't think anyone wanted to see that. Nineteen. He's on the scoreboard at long last. Having just won frame six with his highest break of the evening, 60.
Wasn't a very good break of shot actually from this. Actually, you can see it will go from there. Yeah. yeah. Taking the option to go into them. I'm a little surprised by that, you know. I think John Wee. a chance for Ding. That was a chance for Lazarski. Sixteen. I was saying about the rankings, the next it's top what? sixteen guaranteed the crucible. Everyone else has to win three best of nineteens to qualify. His position in the rankings is very healthy, especially on the more recent results. He had a very big difference. This is why this cops. Yes, and like they're all ranking events, aren't they? All three. No. Could it be his last shot? Depends on this, perhaps. At the top level, he's won this tournament and many others as well, and that has played its part tonight. <laughs> Both of which he won on the black were incredible, really. And of course, the fact he's meeting with Luca Brussel on Thursday. Threat to anybody. Third. The match ball. that I've not seen him do very often. Been some beautiful little shots in this match. Well, if he pots this red, then it's surely over. And in it goes. Well, it's a very competitive era. Five. But as I say, not the debut he was hoping for. The killer frame, certainly the fourth frame, he really should have won. Ten. Fourth tournament in 2011. 90. It's 6-1. It's been an eventful evening here. It really has a very entertaining evening as well.